Hello and welcome to SpaMedica.com TV. My name is Dr. Stephen Mulholland, Plastic Surgery in Toronto, Canada. Welcome again. Hope you've been enjoying our shows. Uh, today, I think you'll find fascinating the five minute nose job, also known as the injectable rhinoplasty. Uh, I, like other physicians, have been doing this five minute nose job for a good eight or nine years. For patients who have nasal facial disproportion, a problem with the nose that they're unhappy with, a bump or a scoop, irregularity or a crooked nose or a bulbous tip and they don't want to do surgery, they want to see what it might look like before during surgery. This is the perfect candidate for the five minute nose job. Let's take a look at one person's experience. Coming up on the news hour, if you're in the market for a new nose, well, there's a new trend. We'll tell you about the new procedure that doesn't require a knife. It's been a busy day in the newsroom. Let's get started. The news hour begins right now. Awarded Best Newscast, The News Hour, with Leslie Roberts and Ann Muskowski. It seems like every other week another celebrity is getting plastic surgery. However, not everyone's up for the idea of being under the knife for hours, not to mention the potential for weeks of recovery. But what if we told you that there's a nose job that can be done on your lunch break? Mina Ree has the details, but a warning, some of the images may make our sensitive viewers a little squeamish. They say it's caused them to feel insecure their entire lives. Years ago at school, you know, all the bullings and everything. You have a big nose, you have a crooked nose. It's made me feel very self-conscious. So in photographs, I always make sure that I'm looking dead on. I don't ever turn my head. Julie Mapera wishes her sunglasses would just stay put. I don't have a nose bridge. We're going to do our five-minute nose job today. It'll be over before you know it. A nose job in a matter of minutes? It's possible, thanks to a syringe instead of the dreaded scalpel. Okay, it looks great, Julie. I might do 100 surgical nose jobs a year, but I'll do 150 to 200 injection nose jobs. I use the sharp needle only to get under the skin. The rest is done with something called a microcannula, which has a blunt tip to minimize swelling. It displaces veins, doesn't lacerate them or injure them, so you don't get the same bruising. It's all it's done with one poke. Multiple possible. areas of the nose filled and in with Juvederm. Local right anesthetic here. is built and right into the gel. We're done. It's kind of ironic. We make it bigger to make it look smaller becomes an optical illusion. Apparently, this all began as a sort of experiment with Dr. Mulholland initially using saline to show prospective nose job patients what they could expect following plastic surgery. Then it occurred to him that he could use the same injectables that he was using to build up the cheeks and chins of other patients to achieve a longer lasting result. So your tip doesn't plunge anymore. And look how straight your bridge is. The procedure allows those contemplating rhinoplasty to try on a nose with results lasting up to two years. It's got lidocaine in it. It lasts a long time. It's reversible. All of this to prevent the so-called Michael Jackson effect, where constant surgical tweaking whittled away at his cartilage. Bumps filled, bridges built, there's no downtime once the so-called five-minute nose job is done. It's very strange to see yourself initially. No bump and so fast. It's going to take me a little bit to get used to it and to recognize that when I see myself in the profile, it's going to look completely different. Mina Ree, Global News. In five minutes, you can achieve the kind of nasal facial proportion you've been thinking about for years. Uh, so, the five-minute nose job, an injectable rhinoplasty. Check out more information on www.spotmedica.com or come in and see me. We can talk about achieving the kind of nose, shape and form you've been looking for.